Hi, it's Damien Carbon with your national news briefing. The government is doubling down on what it describes as a strong relationship with Solomon Islands. Finance Minister Simon Birmingham insists there are still proactive conversations happening between Australia and the island nation. We have secured important commitments from the Solomon Islands not have any foreign military bases established in the Solomon Islands, but Australia remains their partner of choice when it comes to security issues. It comes as the Biden administration warns the Pacific Island nation the United States will take unspecified action should the new pact with China threaten either the US or its allies. Meantime, both the opposition leader and the Prime Minister were not cited today. Anthony Albanese expected out of isolation on Thursday in time for the Labor campaign launch in Perth next Sunday. It's day one under eased COVID rules in New South Wales and Victoria with close contact isolation rules scrapped and a change to some mask requirements. Queensland, South Australia and the ACT should follow suit later this week. Infectious disease professor May Ru Shul has told the ABC the next few months will be a trial period to see what living with COVID looks like before winter sets in. Probably a gradual move to testing and identifying how can we incorporate the public health system in a way that doesn't impact on the health system. And the WA Premier's family has received messages of support from both the Prime Minister and the Opposition Leader this afternoon. The Prime Premier has been hit with COVID, along with one of his children who's in a serious condition in hospital. With Money Me, you get low interest rates and approvals in minutes. Download the Money Me app today. Approved applicants only. T's and C's apply. In sport, Adelaide have beaten the Western Bulldogs by one point. The Crows getting there in Ballarat by the barest of margins, eight goals, 15 to nine, eight. They're now underway at Adelaide Oval with Port hosting the West Coast Eagles. Then tonight, it's Carlton taking on Fremantle at Optus Stadium in Perth. Paddy Cripps back for the Blues, with Lockie Schultz returning for Frio. And a boost for Essendon ahead of the Anzac Day blockbuster at the MCG on Monday against Collingwood. Jake Stringer is expected back for the Bombers. Buying or selling rural residential properties? Yellow Wood fine with some light winds dropping down to 7 degrees tonight for the limestone coast. Mostly sunny, 23 the top tomorrow, partly cloudy, 23 for Monday as well. And the listener app is the new home of your local news. Join now to listen live or on demand.